Well, as always, we try and look out for you in the morning with tips on how to protect yourself and your home. All right, and right now, one of the best things you can do is protect your pipes from these freezing temperatures. News 13's David Romero live in the KRQE kitchen right now with more. All right, David, tell us how to uh, protect our homes. Well, Matt, of course, we told you last half hour about how leaving the sink on a nice slow drip is going to help keep those pipes from freezing. And here's another tip to prevent all those problems altogether. Now, that's making sure that your furnace is in good working order. The idea behind that is keeping the house at a good temperature and, of course, well above anywhere near freezing. Now, that also brings to mind one of the other tips we mentioned earlier, leaving the doors to the cabinet open under the sink where the pipes are located. That's especially important if these pipes are against a wall that backs up to an outer wall. Check your filters, make sure your filters are clean, make sure you have good airflow. Number one cause of a heater failing is a clogged filter. Heater fails, house freezes, pipes freeze. And of course, the other thing you have to look out for are those outdoor water spigots that you hook a hose up to. Most of the home improvement uh, stores around town sell covers that you can easily put on there yourself. That's going to help keep those from freezing outside as well. Matt, back to you. All right, great point, David. You know you don't want to get hosed by all this winter weather. Now, if you want a checklist to see what you can do to protect your home, you can find it at krqe.com. Just look under news links and extra the morning section. I apologize. All right.